cut from a single piece of billet aluminum. Each cut crafted like a painter's brushstroke. Custom tailored for your racing needs. Dart's custom-made billet blocks and heads are engineered around your vision to make the maximum power you need to win races. Take a look inside as we show you how a 500-pound piece of billet turns into a 150-pound big block that's destined to create over 3,000 horsepower from a pro-modified race car. When going to Dart machinery with an engine block, the engine builder or racer provides Dart with the goal. Dart assists them in finalizing those specifications and what they are actually looking to build. Dart digs into their files of proven winners and build customized block in CAD then deliver in a solid form. Very common and popular options in billet block technologies include a tall deck, wide bore spacing, wide pan rails, tall cam locations, as well as moved and revised lifter angles and or lifter placement. All these attributes help to design a bigger and better engine. DART also exceeds in the ability to think outside the box. DART provides options to engine builders and racers, so when they're able to dream, DART assists them in turning that dream into a reality. Whether it's meshing two different platforms, bank offsets, head bolt patterns, or putting a Ford head on a Dodge block, DART is able to engineer those opportunities into the platform to meet a customer's needs. The Sportsman's Billet Block was a great opportunity to reduce manufacturing and engineering costs by creating a pre-constructed box. DART offers a block within certain specifications that meet manufacturing requirements with ease, which in turn passes cost savings on to the end-user customer. Now that you have an idea about the effort it takes to just design a custom set of heads or block, let's take a look at how these parts are born from huge blocks of aluminum. All of DART's billet core is derived from a drawn process in which the manufactured aluminum is drawn through rollers shortly after it's poured to help compress and align its grain structure. The foundry then inspects the grain structure on a microscopic level and identifies the location of the strongest part of the core. This is where DART machines the crankshaft's main journals. Once DART receives the raw blocks from the foundry, they're cut to the point at which the block or heads looks mostly like it should, with all the critical holes, like bores and intake ports, left with more material. The roughed out pieces then go to heat treat to help harden the metal. Sometimes specifications can change slightly during heat treat, which is why DART leaves in this additional material in place. Final operations at DART's machining facility are inclusive of quality. Quality control includes checking heat treat, surfaces, and bore treatments. One in every five products goes through a CMM and given one last visual check before being put on a truck and shipped to DART's distribution facility. The final stop for the billet heads and blocks is DART's headquarters in Troy, Michigan. Here the billet pieces go through a rigorous visual inspection of virtually every hole in the parts. At this point the heads can be shipped to the customer or there are further finishing options that can be performed on the heads. Some of these options include the installation of valve guides and seats, plus a custom port and polish job on DART's 5-axis CNC machine. The blocks have a few more steps before they're ready for shipment. First they are line honed, then immediately bore honed to make way for the ductile iron sleeves. Once the hone is completed, the block is heated to slightly expand the bores to allow for easier installation of the sleeves. At this point, the block is ready to ship to the customer. DART's billet block and heads program allows engine builders to fully customize the design of an engine to create a truly one-off engine combination. It allows for a variety of engine enhancements to squeeze every ounce of power from every cylinder. Now the next time you head to the racetrack and see a 5-second Pro Mod go screaming down the track, you'll know a little bit more about the technology and care that goes into building these 3,000-plus horsepower engines.